And in that segment tonight, a private legal practitioner and former member of parliament, John Indebugri, has cited a possible case of contempt against the PPP for submitting its filing fee despite an interlocutory injunction it has, played, it, it has placed on the fee. Filed a suit at the High Court on September 19, seeking an interlocutory injunction to prevent the Electoral Commission from receiving the nominations. On Thursday, the Electoral Commission said it could not accept filing fees from the presidential and parliamentary aspirants because of the injunction. However, the EC collected that of the PPP when the party's chairman, Brew Hammond, presented it together with the party's nomination forms. Speaking on TV3's Eye on the Seat program, Program, John in Dubuguri said, acting contrary to the petition does not only weaken their case, but the PPP could also be cited for contempt. There is an injunction against the Electoral Commission receiving these monies until 11th October when the matter has been heard and determined. So for you, before 11th October, to go and tender, you were actually in contempt of court. Former Attorney General and Minister for Justice, Ni Aikwe Otu, expressed similar sentiments. It amounts to some kind of acquiescence. I mean, you have said you cannot pay, if you like, or you think it is too high, it is capricious, it is arbitrary, so, 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 on and on. So you've gone to court, and all of a sudden you find a means, and you say, I'm going to pay. There are those who went to court, and there are the same people who say, now we want to pay. So yes. what is the effect of that? Policy advisor of the PPP, Kofi Asamoasia, however, defended the action of the PPP. The application does not vitiate the requirement in CI 94. The injunction was not restraining presentation of the deposit if somebody decided to present it. It was to restrain the receipt or the collection of it. So you can't turn around and say we were trapping the electoral commission. The order was directed at somebody not to do that. That is different from the applicant. Eye on the seat will be aired tomorrow at 6 p.m.